hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, the delays won't be that bad. Variety Immigration Law is a great resource for the latest in immigration news and trends. Please be sure to subscribe to our channel. It really helps out the channel. And click that notification bell so you never miss a video from Berardi Immigration Law. Hi everyone, this is Tiffany McKenzie from Berardi Immigration Law, and I'm here today with an update about the strike. So as we talked about last week, um, a well, quite a few um, federal civil servants in Canada were on strike, but on Monday, they actually came to an agreement. So in terms of immigration services, um, they are back to work. So what does that mean, really? Well, you know, they were on strike for about a week and a half. So hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, the delays won't be that bad. Um, but really, at this point, uh, things should hopefully go back to normal. So I know my inbox was suddenly flooded with quite a few emails from Immigration Canada on Monday. So they are certainly back um, and everything should be hopefully resuming. Now, there are still some um part of the Canadian civil services on strike, specifically the Canada Revenue Agency workers. Uh, they're on a, they're in a slightly different unit than the immigration um, IRCC workers were. But as it stands for now, they are back. There is a tentative deal that has been struck. And hopefully, you know, it wasn't, you know, it was only a week and a half. Hopefully that doesn't add to what are already some horrific delays in the Canadian immigration system. So you know, if you have any questions, you know, definitely reach out. But hopefully, hopefully smooth sailing from here on out. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like our video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and hit that notification button so you never miss one of these important updates. Also, check out the Berardi blog that's on our website at berardiimmigrationlaw.com. The blog is updated two to three times a week, contains tons of up-to-date information on policies and trends. You won't want to miss it.